Hi, my name is Alan Tao and I help students master AP Physics. Today I actually want to talk to you about why college professors aren't necessarily the best at teaching. Now, this came about because I've worked with a lot of students who complain about their teachers in high school. <laughs> and this is not necessarily true, but I do get these complaints like the teacher doesn't understand, doesn't explain things, and they feel like they just don't get a lot of help from their teachers. And, and there's a lot of reasons for that. I don't want to put the blame on teachers necessarily, but a lot of students come in with this perspective that like, oh, when I get to college, I'm going to have more brilliant people. I'm going to have smarter people. I'm going to people who know what they're teaching. They know their subject and they're going to be amazing teachers at it. And one of the things I want to disabuse of your, uh, and one of the things I want to point out as a word of caution is that this is not always true, especially in STEM oriented fields like the sciences, math, or engineering fields or computer science or anything like that. So one thing that is true about college professors is they are extremely brilliant. They know their field extremely, extremely well. And they're going to be some of the smartest people you have ever encountered. If you go to a very top tier school, these are people who are going to be at the top of their fields. They're going to be brilliant and you can learn a lot from them. However, they are not hired. They are not at the top of their field because they are the best at teaching it's a skill and like most skills some people are better at it and some people are not as so good at it I've had the privilege of learning from some of the most brilliant professors out there and I could tell you they are not necessarily amazing at teaching it because in some ways this material is so easy for them that they don't quite understand and relate what you're struggling with they don't understand how come you just don't get this how come this isn't natural because some of this stuff, even like calculus, multivariable calculus, linear algebra, any like kind of higher level math classes to them are very, very elementary. It's kind of like all of you know your times tables. That doesn't necessarily mean you're all going to be fantastic at teaching second graders how to multiply numbers. Just because you're an expert at it doesn't actually make you fantastic at teaching it. Because that's a different skill than just knowing it. And so... A lot of students of mine who go to college, they come back and they're like, I just don't feel like I understand my professor. The other thing you have to remember about professors is they are hired for a reason. They're hired because they're at the top of their fields. And that means that they're very brilliant. They do amazing research. They earn grants. They bring money and prestige to the university. But that doesn't mean that it translates into an amazing educational experience. So I want you to keep that in mind that you're going to go through this journey of college and you may have to teach yourself quite a lot. Even if you feel like in high school, you're having to teach yourself a lot and no one's there to explain things to you. That isn't necessarily going to change in college either. And what I want you to keep in mind is that you are in charge of what you're going to learn. It doesn't matter the greatest teachers, the greatest tutors, the greatest whoever None of that really matters because it's up to you to get a handle on the material and learn it. You're going to have to seek out resources that might be outside of your college professor's realm, might be more your TAs or other people who have a better handle and may be better equipped to teach things to you. Now, don't get me wrong. It doesn't mean all college professors are bad at teaching, but I just want you to understand that just because they are at a higher level, just because they are brilliant, just because they know all the answers to everything that they're doing and this seems very easy to them does not mean that it will be very easy to explain to you or that they will understand what you are struggling with. Drop a comment below if you've had good or bad experiences with your college professors, especially in any of the STEM subjects.